What's up, personal nation? This is Mike. I'm here with Ben, and we just did a head-to-head -head cinnamon cereal milk competition. Astro Flav took on First Form. They sent the tub for free, but we have no other relationship with them yet. But after that review, yeah, we gotta oh, get yeah. A, we gotta get a coupon code and an affiliate. We gotta do whatever it is because this company is straight bringing up some serious flavor. I feel like we're watching like a new contender in the UFC, just coming in like first round yes. knocks out Conor yeah. McGregor. Like, <laughs> it was like, I feel like the Legion of Boom just got knocked Dude, out. Dude, it was, it's, so it's a straight isolate. Iso mix is the flavor, is the product that we're reviewing. What they're doing is they're adding a little MCT powder to thicken it up. Yeah. And you can tell it's an aggressive isolate because they're saying you gotta mix one scoop with eight to 10 ounces of water. A lot of times isolates are with six ounces of water. So right off the bat. Yeah. Um, what where's, the where's the cinnamon, grab that one. Yeah, dude, open that thing up. That smells so good. So the, the flavor has got a sharp cinnamon bark. It was great. But overall though, now I, this is the video I've, I've been wanting to open this tub since it, we arrived in the mail like last week. Peanut butter and jelly. The only other peanut butter and jelly flavor I've ever done was USN has, mm -hmm. uh, oh, what's the whey called? They have a whey protein. Blue way or something like that? Maybe. Yeah, I remember it being very unique. I don't remember if it was good or bad. It was, I remember it was good. Like, I remember, see, they got a double whoa, thing here going on here. I just remember thinking, like, peanut butter and jelly is a very unique flavor for a protein, especially because there's like bread, peanut butter, and jelly. There's mm -hmm. like multiple. So I'm interested to see how they accomplish that. Yeah, and, and you also got to realize, like, we're doing a taste off. We have to think, are you gonna be able to get through like a whole tub of this though? That, yeah. That's one of those flavors that, huh? I don't know, I'm like a little bit cautious on. I have not. Yeah, I try to think like a consumer, like uh. <laughs> I smell. I smell like all the stages, like smell, I smell the bread. I smell, yeah, it's doughy peanut butter is what I smell. Yeah. I don't know about the jelly yet, but I didn't even put my nose very, in it. Very, very, very light jelly, but I feel like the jelly will probably come out better in the liquid. It smells like, yeah, like the Smucker's combo yeah. peanut butter jelly thing. Oh, this could be fun. So like I was saying, I, I try to think as a consumer here that is only gonna be able, like I think when, when I was in college, I could only afford like one 10 pound bag of real gains from Universal. Right, for right, uh -huh. So, <coughs> well, I guess. That's how good that was, Maybe me sneeze. This one's obviously not gonna be for the peanut allergy folks out here. Speaking of sneezing, level that off. That's a big scoop for a pure isolate right here. Well, like we said in the other video, they did, they're, they're taking a couple extra liberties here with their yes. flavoring. Mm -hmm. They are, you know, using extra things to make sure it's thick, mm -hmm. flavorful. MCT. It's an isolate. It's not a way, it's a, not a way mix like we were talking about versus ghost. Right. But there is a dash of sodium caseinate in here. So if you have case allergies, beware. It's not a pure, pure isolate, but all the protein pretty much is coming from isolate. Right. They also have. Um, so the MCT blend from Palm and Kernel Oil, but also a little bit of orga organic agave inulin to thicken things up too. Yeah. So that might add a smidge of carbohydrate. Macro wise, we're looking at 140 calories and that's 25 grams of protein, three grams of carbs, two of which are fiber. So the inulin is actually adding another gram of that compared to usual. And then how much fat? Two grams of fat. Not bad. Not saturated, probably coming from the peanut flour. I gotta assume there's peanut right. flour out of this, but whatever. So this isn't like a pure, pure isolate. It's yeah. an isolate with a little bit extra. Mm -hmm. uh, let me grab cups. I got them. So this, you know, I think most people, if you're not getting ready, if you're not in your last four weeks before a bodybuilding competition, this is gonna be fine for you. Um, you should be able to find room in your diet for oh, yeah, either, fat. Oh, either way. It looks like liquefied oh. peanut butter. Oh my God, I smell that. What? I smell some grape. Yeah, now I just smell more grape than the peanut butter. That's weird because the powder is more of the peanut butter. But I've said that a couple times. Usually when you add it to the liquid, all of a sudden, like... As it brings your mouth, the peanut flour is starting to flow down it. Holy sh... Peanut. Dude, these guys are for real. Brands to watch out wow. for 2020. Okay, so admittedly, I'm going to admit this, I'm not a great person, this is grape jelly. Yes, I'm it is. I'm hoping it would be strawberry mm -hmm. jelly, because I like strawberry jelly Agreed. more. But the pure feat that they're achieving This here, is unbelievable. Oh, that do, is, they, do they show grape jelly? I mean, it's purple, so... It's purple, that's They could do yeah. another one of these. If they do the exact same thing with strawberry... Could you imagine, like, like on the shelf, like they do at grocery stores, they got the grape jelly, yeah, strawberry jelly? Yeah, they could have three different flavors or whatever. This is fantastic. Wow. Can you drink a whole tub of this? 
It's n okay, like, I'm, I'm just being honest here. I'm not a great person. I couldn't drink a whole top of this. If they made it strawberry, I could probably demolish a tub of this. You're gonna say that you could though, because you like grape. Yeah, if you have, I'm not a huge grape lover. This is that good. This is so well mixed. Oh my God, dude, who are these guys? Here's what I'll say. If you're gonna put the word flave in your, you got, it's in your brand name, good. it's gotta be this good and it is. Holy crap. I, <sighs> I don't know how they did this. This is, I mean, this is almost bizarre. Like, you can't just throw flavors into a powder and just taste like this. Like, like there's stages of the flavors when you drink it. But for me, for me, I'm getting it all at the same time. I'm not getting the stages. I'm just liking it all oh, at the same time. I get peanut butter, mm -hmm. grape, peanut butter. Yeah, you're left with that. But the grape's still there. They're in like different areas of the mouth. It's like the flavors hit the different taste bud receptors. I'll say like the, the grape kind of like linger in the top of my mouth. But peanuts like just all the over. Pe yeah, peanut butter. Well, I think it's like the peanut butter. If there's peanut butter flour in this, it probably coats very well. Right. Dude. This is insane. Well done. We were having a fun time talking about the cinnamon cereal milk or whatever, the cinnamon crunch flavor. That's definitely my flavor from this company. That one was insanely impressive. Just the thickness that they were able to pull out of an isolate and just, it tastes like cereal, mm -hmm. cereal milk. If you think you might like this flavor and you're cool, grape. You yeah, will. you have to make sure. Yeah, I, I, I kind of wish they wrote grape on here because yes. if I was a consumer and I saw this, the jelly almost kind of looks a little strawberry, you know? Mm, yeah, but the thing's purple. But the thing is purple, but yeah. the text is red is what blew me off. Oh, okay, gotcha. So I was like, mm -hmm. I was sitting here thinking like, I don't know if this is gonna be grape or strawberry. Well, that's why we're here, man. Dude. Welcome aboard Astro Flav. We are very excited. 2020 yeah. is gonna be a fun year for this. We might have to do a blind taste testing against one of the other peanut butter and jellies. Oh, I, I doubt. Said. I doubt anyone's gonna beat this. This is this is really good. That's impressive. I mean, and they're it's very understated too. They're like we're Astro Flav. Like it says flavor in the name, but they're not like you gotta be. I don't like when people call us and like we got the best flavor in the world. Like guess what? Everyone has the best flavor in the world. This. Uh, welcome to 2020. Woo! <laughs> All right, subscribe to the channel. Go back and check out our video on the Cinnamon Crunch head to head with First Form. Mm -hmm. Took down a contender. Wow. Okay, well, we're going to have to check out more stuff from Astro Flav. They have some really interesting looking products, but. I'm excited to see what else comes from them. Because if, if that Cinnamon Toast Crunch and this peanut butter and jelly are that impressive. I'm not afraid to recommend this to almost anyone. Yeah. I, mean, I think it's that good. Wow. That's how you know he likes it. And he oh. goes for the second cup. Dude, it's that good. Alright, we'll see you guys later. Welcome to Price Plow.